We are not going to trust words. We're going to trust actions, and we haven't seen actions. The families of two indigenous women whose remains are believed to be in a Manitoba landfill are disappointed after a meeting with the Crown Indigenous Relations Minister Monday in Ottawa regarding a possible landfill search. The remains of Morgan Harris and Mercedes Myron are believed to be in the Prairie Green landfill north of Winnipeg. The families have been calling on the Manitoba and federal governments to fund a search. It's very much you know, them versus us, uh, you know, the state versus their wards. The families of the missing women traveled to Ottawa to meet with Crown Indigenous Relations Minister Gary Anandasangari. Kirsten Witwicky, the cousin of Morgan Harris, says they were hoping to hear that the feds were going to fund the search. I think if the pandemic has taught us anything, that if the government finds a problem important enough, they will throw millions of dollars at it uh, very quickly. Uh, so the problem is that you know, this just isn't a big enough problem for them to immediately solve. Melissa Robinson, cousin of Morgan Harris, says words by the minister and those in all levels of government mean nothing right now. We're angry, we're tired, but you know what? I, I feel like they, they keep stalling, they keep pushing this off. But this search the landfills is, is growing stronger. Manitoba NDP leader Wab Kanu said if elected, his government would commit to a search of the landfill, while the Manitoba Liberals have promised to fund half the search. But Heather Stephenson and the PCs are still against funding a search due to health and safety concerns. A federally funded feasibility report completed in May found a search could take up to three years and cost upwards of $184 million. Nigan Sinclair says nothing can really move forward without the green light from the Manitoba government. Then what you get is you get a minister who's ambivalent or benevolent, not sure, and not able to move forward because, frankly, the federal government, especially in a minority parliament, especially with a government that's uh, facing criticism for their work in Indigenous issues, uh, they're probably not going to step up uh, with $184 million. Monday marked International Day of Action to search the landfills in an effort to pressure the governments to do something. Rallies were held from coast to coast, including right here in Winnipeg. Deneen Chief drove to Winnipeg from Wabagoon Lake Ojibwe Nation in Ontario to show her support. As a mother and as a grandmother, I know that if my child was in the landfill, I would want it searched. and. I'm sure that there's ways that can, it can be done safely. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpa, City News.